Adults can apply, be interviewed, and even get physicals on site at the event. It's all a part of a push to get more drivers in the seats of these buses. It's one of the biggest barriers to getting kids to school on time. Not enough bus drivers. JCPS says it currently has around 570 bus drivers to transport more than 65,000 students to and from school. And every day, the district has around 40 or more drivers who call out. So every day we start with a deficit. Every day we start with fewer bus drivers than we have routes. That means other drivers are picking up the slack and covering more routes, leading kids to getting to school or home late. So they do their route and then they swing back around and do that route of someone who's missing. To combat this problem, the district is hosting a hiring blitz on Saturday. You just need a clean driving record, the ability to pass a background check and drug screen, along with a passion for helping kids. I hear people all the time say, how can I give back? How can I help our students? What can we do? This is a great way you can do that. As they make an effort to hire people, school board members are planning to discuss different options for transportation at Tuesday's meeting. They're looking at a few options, such as keeping things the same, no longer providing transportation to magnet students, or a possible hub where we would have a certain amount of hubs throughout the city where folks would bring their students almost like a depot that we currently have. The district plans to host community sessions to discuss the options before voting at a later date. Madison Elliott, WLKY News.